Atma, an essential subject from Vinaypedia we tend to identify ourselves with the bodies that we are in, but careful study of the scriptures will enable us to understand that this material body is just a covering of our original selves. The moment this body perishes, we take up another body. This process of changing bodies is compared to changing one's clothes in the Bhagavad GT, which leads us to conclude that the body is just a temporary covering. In order to break free from this cycle of birth and death, we must realize that we are not this body, but are the soul within. The Sanskrit term for soul is Atma. Since we are parts and parcels of the Supreme Lord, we are known as Jivatmas, while the Supreme Lord is known as Paramatma, Param meaning the highest and Atma meaning soul. Srila Prabhupada's books, lectures, conversations and letters offer a comprehensive presentation of this essential subject as seen in the Vinikot's Atma category. An introduction from his books is given below in the following eight quotes. Quotes from Srila Prabhupada's books Tmavit means a self-realized soul or bona fide spiritual master. Unless one is self-realized and knows what his relationship with the super soul is, he cannot be a bona fide spiritual master. Here it is recommended that one should seek out a bona fide spiritual master and surrender unto him, Arkanam, for by inquiring from and worshipping him one can learn spiritual activities. R. Mad B.H. Gavadam 3.28 2. DM means the body or the mind, but here the word Dmavan especially means that one should be self-possessed. He should always remain in the pure consciousness that he is spirit soul and not the material body or the mind. That will make him progress confidently in Kaya consciousness. R. Mad B. H. Gavadam 3.27 8. R.L.A.U.K. Devagazdam says that for purification of both wrong conceptions, the Lord presented his eternal form before Brahmja, being fully satisfied by Brahm's non-deceptive vow of discharging Bhakti Yoga. Except for Bhakti Yoga, any method for realization of Tma Tattva or the science of DM will prove deceptive in the long run. R. Mad B. H. Gavadam 2.9 4. The word DM denotes body, mind and soul depending upon different circumstances. In the yoga system, the mind and the conditioned soul are especially important. Since the mind is the central point of yoga practice, DM refers here to the mind. The purpose of the yoga system is to control the mind and to draw it away from attachment to sense objects. Bhagavad GT 6.5 Those who are not Matatvavit, who do not know the spiritual value of life, can be satisfied with external material opulences, but those who are Matatvavit are not inspired by material opulence. This is the instruction we can derive from the life and activities of Sabhari Muni. R. Mad B. H. Gavadam 9.6 4546, when one chants the holy name of the Lord in ecstasy, not caring for outward social conventions, it is to be understood that he is Atma Mahdi. In other words, his consciousness is turned toward the Supreme Personality of Godhead. R. Mad B. H. Gavadam 7.735, when the Lord descends from that world to this world, he descends in his spiritual body of Tma Mwai, or internal potency, without any touch of the Bahiraji Mwai, or external, material energy. The allegation that the impersonal Brahman appears in this material world by accepting a material body is quite absurd. Therefore the Lord, when he comes here, has not a material body, but a spiritual body. The impersonal Brahma, Jyotra is only the glaring effulgence of the body of the Lord. R. Mad B. H. Gavadam 2.7 26. According to the MMS philosophers, everything is eternal, Nitya, and according to the Eskaya philosophers, everything is mythi, or Anitya impermanent. Nonetheless, without real knowledge of Tma, the soul, such philosophers must be bewildered and must continue to lament as Dras. R. Mad B. H. Gavadam 7.2. 49.